Bitcoin, a completely digital next generation currency that uses blockchain technology and is not dependent on any central authorities. It was developed by an anonymous person or group of people who went under the pseudonym Satoshi Nakamoto. The first Bitcoin block was created on January 3rd, 2009. But the technologies that led to the emergence of Bitcoin and the search for alternative payment instruments date back a lot further than this. So, what were the developments that made Bitcoin possible? and became a worldwide phenomenon in such a short time. In 1973, AT&T has developed the Unix operating system at Bell Labs. With this in place, there was a basis for hacker culture to be born. In 1974, TCPIP, what we now know as the Internet, was developed as the Network Communication Protocol. With these principles in place, computers were able to communicate. A year later, Whitfield Dilphy and Martin Hellman introduced public key encryption to the world. This was a big step forward for privacy and data transfer security in cryptography. Three years later, Frederick Hayek published the text Denationalization of Money. Hayek argued that central banks were unnecessary and should not have free reign to print money. He suggested creating competitive conditions between currencies in a financial market. In 1982, American cryptographer and computer scientist David Chaum developed a digital signature method that allowed messages to be transmitted without being traced. This method was effectively the first example of digital encryption ever, a key step in the birth of Bitcoin. Cypherpunks, who emerged in 1988, played a key role in the emergence of Bitcoin. That year, Timothy C. May published The Crypto Anarchist Manifesto. May had foreseen the future of information technology. He argued that without the need for real names or identification information, anyone could communicate digitally, signing off, arise, you have nothing to lose but your barbed wire fences. In 1989, David Chaum developed DigiCash, one of the first cryptocurrency experiments. He had created an alternative payment network using computers and the internet. DigiCash, the ancestor of digital currencies, was an online alternative for regular payments. However, it was not a decentralized company and went bankrupt because it constantly needed support from banks. In 1991, Stuart Haber and W. Scott Stornetta outlined the timestamp method, effectively a way to prevent digital documents being modified. The system stored documents in an encrypted, secure blockchain. At the time, this technology was not used and its patent expired four years before Bitcoin's emergence. The World Wide Web becomes publicly accessible in 1991. The cypherpunks began their collaboration in San Francisco the same year. 1997 saw the publishing of a cyberpunks manifesto by Christian S. Kirchev. We are those who see reality different than others, he said. Developments began to accelerate. In the same year, Nix Bazo developed the first examples of smart contracts and Adambach begins experimenting with a proof-of-work mechanism. Another cryptocurrency experiment called Bitgold was developed in 1998 by Nix Bazo. B-Money, developed by Weidai, used a decentralized database in a similar trial. A year later, Napster arrives. Although it was for exchanging music, it was the birth of the direct peer-to-peer -peer transfers we know today. Five years later, Hal Finney developed the reusable proof-of-work mechanism. This made verification far more secure. His proposal was extremely close to the actual method used for Bitcoin. Jörg Guido Hülsman then published his The Ethics of Money Production, another piece of text leaded Bitcoin's creation. On October 31, 2008, a document titled Bitcoin, Peer-to-Peer -peer Electronic Cash System was published by Satoshi Nakamoto. On January 3, 2009, the first block of the Bitcoin blockchain was produced. Bitcoin's journey from 2009 to the present day had begun. And finally, the first Bitcoin Turkish Lira transaction was made on BTC Turk between Kerem Tibuk and BTC Turk CTO Ozan Yurtseven in 2013.